Good morning, Memphis, and welcome to our internet listeners and podcast listeners across the 50 states. You're on Real Estate Mortgage Shop. I'm Joe Garner, your host, mortgage loan officer. You can connect with me at jogarner.com. Our general topic today is count the reasons to be thankful for owning your home. Call us while we're live on the air and tell us the reasons you are thankful for owning your home. Uh, Subscribe to get Real Estate Mortgage Shop podcast with show notes at jogarner.com. Call us while we're live today, which is November 23rd, 2019. Today we're going to be sharing some examples and some stories of people who have become very thankful for owning their own homes. Uh, We're going to be talking about five wealth building aspects of real estate. A home is your castle and it is a neighborhood where your children are going to grow up, where your family stories are going to take place and are going to be, those stories are going to be retold for years during the family holidays. 901-482-0354. Let's talk about your plans. You can also connect with me at jogarner.com. You're on Real Estate Mortgage Shop. I am Joe Garner, your host mortgage loan officer. You can connect with me at jogarner.com. Uh, you can also find me hanging around Sierra Pacific Mortgage. We've got Mark Loden. We're going to bring Mark Loden in. He's got an interesting uh, concept about personal budget systems that we've been watching now for a few months over at some of our business groups, and we're going to have Mark Loden share some of that with you guys. We'll see you guys back in just a moment. 600 WREC and 92.1 FM. I'm Joe Garner, your host, mortgage loan officer. You can connect with me at jogarner.com. You can also call me at 901-482-0354. Well, we're going to do something a little different today. We're going to do the Talk Shop Business Tip for Real Estate Pros. And uh, Talk Shop offers free education and networking to anyone who's interested in business, real estate, or even health care. So uh, Talk Shop is made possible by the financial support of its sponsors. And for more about Talk Shop, go to talkshoppe.com. For our Talk Shop business tip today, we have the Talk Shop financial supporter, Mark Loden of MKL Personal Budgeting Service. Uh, Mark, you can help homeowners and aspiring homeowners to get control of their finances on a flexible personal budgeting system. Mark Loden, we've been very interested listening about your system now for a few months in our business groups. Tell, tell, um, offer our real estate pros a little bit of a business tip on the budgeting side. Well, I tell you, Joe, this is something that they can use right now and for all time. Uh, do any of you expect to have a future expense in the next 12 or 18 months? Most likely you will. And most likely you will put it on the credit card or you'll pay cash and eliminate your cash reserves. I have a better idea. Why not take your best educated guess and set aside money for all future needs? Now, what do I mean? Things that you know you're going to have to need in the future. Ever expect a car repair or car tax or clothes? How about Christmas or gifts? Well, that's for sure. Or insurance or taxes of any kind? Those kind of things. I want you to do one thing. It'll be very helpful. Add what those monthly guesstimated expenses would be and move them to the uh, bank savings account. Let's say you figure it's $300 for car maintenance and all the other things. In the future, take out $300, put it in the savings account, and believe me, you will need that, that money, and you'll be so glad that you did it. And you have a system where you can even help people get started on that so that the computer is actually helping them, the system is actually helping them remember where to appropriate that money. So at the end, you know, later on, you're just building more and more savings. Right. It does all the adding, does all the subtracting, and it matches with your checkbook balance. Love it. Okay, so... We've asked our listeners and our real estate pros out there and homeowners out there to call in and share the reasons that they are counting for value owning their own home. And we've heard from Mark Loden of MKL Personal Budgeting Service. I'm Joe Garner. Connect with me at jogarner.com. We'll see you guys back in just a moment. Tim Van Horn, Monday morning at 6 on 600 WREC and 92.1 FM. There's so much to be thankful for. 
Well, there is so much to be thankful for this Thanksgiving season. You're on Real Estate Mortgage Shop. I am Joe Garner, your host, mortgage loan officer. You can connect with me at jogarner.com. You can also call me at 901-482-0354. We're talking about count the reasons to be thankful for owning your home. Give us a call. We're opening up our uh, call-in line. And the, we've got Mark Loden has come in to the studio. Uh, he's got an interesting concept and you know I can see it really working for people who are scratching their heads saying I am no good at budgeting but I need to do a budget and I don't want to have to do this by myself. Mark has shared uh, for several months some of the things he's done for uh, his clients so uh, Mark how do we contact you? You can contact me at 901-624-0052 or MKL personal Financial Budgeting Service dot com is my uh, website. What uh, d- just out of curiosity, what are some of the things that you actually do with MKL? All right, I have a very unusual service, Joe, that is greatly needed but rarely taught in our high schools and institutions. It's a monthly budget planning. I give people the tools to manage their monthly income by just simply determining their goals and priorities, and I have a sis- simple system of keeping up with it. Without having to write it all down. I love that. That's what I love is the fact that you don't have to write it all down. And I've actually seen it. So it uh, give call, uh, Mark a call. How do we contact you, Mark? 901-624-0052. Thank you so much. And we'll see you guys back in just a moment. I'm Troy McDonald. And I'm Lynn McDonald. With, with the, the Aaron, Aaron McDonald Insurance, Insurance Agency. Agency. From Memphis, Tennessee. And you're listening to the Real Estate Mortgage Shop. And now, back to your host, Joe Garner. I'm Joe Garner, your host, mortgage loan officer. You can connect with me at jogarner.com. In the studio, we have Mark Loden with MKL Budgeting Service. How do we contact you, Mark? Call me at 901-624-0052. Be glad to help you. We've got Kristen on the line. We want to hear from you. What what would you have to say? uh, Joe, I just want to follow up. I heard Mr. Mark Loden speak this morning, and I just wanted to praise uh, him and tell y'all how awesome he was. Um, I've been been with him for two years in December uh, on his budget plan, and I like to tell all my friends it's not a no budget. Uh, Mark has never told me no. He's just said, let's think about how we can do this for you. How can we get this thing for you? And my mom now sees him. A bunch of my friends have, have talked with him, and I'm trying to get them on board and trying to bug them to get with him. My mom <laughs> met with him, and the first time she met with him, she said, I don't know why I didn't do this two years ago. You so know, that's a good point. Have- oh, thank you so much, Kristen, for calling, and um, good for you for getting on that budget. I Amen. really I, I have to give her an A-plus for that. Mm-hmm. Real quick now, we're going to do a real estate tip of the week, and we've got Mark Loden right here to give us a real estate tip of the week. All right, it's getting so close to Christmas that my tip may have uh, needed to come a little bit earlier, but there's always next year. First thought, talk to your family members in charge who are really maybe too old to receive gifts because they're in the 20s and their 30s and their 40s. Uh, Of course, give the little ones a gift, but decide which ones you really do want to give to and not want to give to so you can save some money there. You don't want to give a gift to someone that they, that you cannot afford. Secondly, make a list of each person that you, you're going to give a gift to for Christmas and birthdays, if it applies. Beside each name, put the most you will spend on that individual, both Christmas or birthday, like I said, if it applies for that month, and add up that figure and divide it by 12, what, 12 months, as we did in our first tip, set that money aside in your bank savings, and guess what, in 12 months, you'll have Christmas paid for it, and you'll enjoy it a whole lot more. <laughs> I love it, Mark. Happy Thanksgiving holiday weekend to everybody coming up. Make some great memories with your loved ones. Got a quick quote uh, from Anonymous. Be thankful that you do not have everything you desire. If you did, there would be nothing to look forward to. All right, Mark, anything you want to add? Quickly. Also remember you're making memories in the house that you're in right now. And I've enjoyed the memories of the past of the houses I've lived in. Enjoy the memories that you're making and make them a good memory. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody, and be thankful for the things that didn't happen. Thank you for listening to Real Estate Mortgage Shop, where we offer you solutions to your real estate and financing scenarios. I'm Joe Garner, your host, mortgage professional. Catch this podcast and more at jogarner.com.